Okay, Carolyn, tell me a little bit about your reign here at home as Miss Jamaica Universe. Okay, well, it's been wonderful, you know, I've been busy, very, very busy. Um, I've been doing a lot of charity work. Um, during the month of December, it was really busy because I had to attend a lot of charity functions, especially where kids are concerned. So there was a time when I went to Arnett Gardens and I spent the entire day with the kids and it was a wonderful treat. Um, I've also been involved with the JSPCA and because I'm an animal lover and I have a dog and dogs are the best mm -hmm. companions in the entire world, my little peanut. So um, it's really good that, you know, I can go there whenever I have free time to just visit the animals, you know, the cats, you know, help out. It's not just about going there and saying hi to the kids. It's hard work. I go there in old jeans and t-shirts and I sweat. I actually help to rip the newspaper, change it where the cats, you know, mess around mm -hmm. and, you know, you help to put flea powder on the kittens. And I think it's a way that everybody can help, you know, we all can contribute to something like this. You don't have to have a lot of money. You don't have to donate a million dollars to say you're doing something and you don't have to publicize it because mm -hmm. this is something that I do. I'm not required to do it as Miss Jamaica Universe. It's just something that I've always wanted to do mm -hmm. and this has given me the opportunity to do it. Mm -hmm. um, also, you know, I started the store so that's been taking up a lot of my time mm -hmm. but it's something I love to do and um, I'm also now the brand manager for Miss Jamaica Universe 2010 mm -hmm. and Invite Productions is the new franchise holder for mm -hmm. Miss Jamaica so it's big things. I mean, it's going to be different but good different yes, and I can't okay. wait for the pageant to just start and go up. We have some fabulous girls yes. waiting. Oh God, It's going yeah. to be great, guys. <laughs> Honestly, if you have not thought about it, if you're gorgeous or if you just want to have fun, represent your country, mm -hmm. if you just want the exposure and the experience of gaining confidence Absolutely. and learning how to make up yourself, learning how to carry yourself, how to have poise, it's walking. Not, you know, it's not even just about the physical aspect of it. And you know, okay, you learn how to do your hair, you learn how to do your makeup. You learn small things about being a lady. True. You know, you learn how to sit, you learn how to speak, you learn how to walk into a room and grab, grab people. people. That's I true. mean, it's, and it becomes natural after a while. It's not a show, it becomes a part of you. Mm -hmm. And I think all ladies want to be like that. True, and mm -hmm. one thing I can say from entering the competition, and Caroline, I know you can back me up, yeah. the confidence level you get, Absolutely. when you walk out in a two-piece in front of all of Jamaica mm -hmm. and everybody cheers for you, your confidence goes sky high, trust me. Mm -hmm. And so. it's really, I mean, people will say it's superficial that they're walking on stage and you have a, people who are just drooling over the girls, no, and it's, it's not about that, and no. it's, I think it's a wonderful aspect of the pageant because that is where you get to show off your fitness. You know, it's a part of, it is a beauty pageant. So it's beauty of face, beauty of body, and of course, personality, because without the personality, you're just not going it to make shit. it. You're not going to cut right. it. Really, yeah. <laughs> yes. So those who love to watch beautiful women, just come out, watch the show, enjoy it. Ladies that want to enter, or if you just want the experience, like I said, come. Mm -hmm. Hang out with us, learn about this stuff. You know, Carolyn and I will both be hands on. Absolutely. You know, and it's just going to be a wonderful experience. It's a lot of fun. It's like a big sleepover. It's not. It's not what everybody thinks. It's not catty. It's not girls trying to step on each other. It's just like. As I said, a big sleepover. When I was at the international pageant, we went to the other girls' rooms. We'd just make fun. We'd make fun of Miss China and go knock on her door, and she'd come out. Hey, what the hell is going on? You know, it's just yeah. fun, and that is what I mean. It helps to build character, and it helps to make you a stronger person.